Welcome back to FaceTime on Capital Today. We are talking about branding with our two special guests, Hisham Noor, the brand, a brand development consultant, as well as Jasmine Abdullah, the Chief Operating Officer of Jimbori Play and Music Malaysia Bravo Sundar Berhad. So, just now we are talking about the internet and social media, which we're going to touch on in a moment. But first, I'd like to put this question to Jasmine. We all know that uh, Jimbori's brand overseas was very strong. 15 years ago. So when, when you brought it in, of course, that's one of the greatest challenges is to create uh, that, to harness the powers of that branding uh, for, for Malaysians here. So how do you go about creating greater awareness in terms of putting Jimbery out there among Malaysian parents? Okay. Um, to begin with, it, because I, I, I understand the fact that Jimbery is a very strong brand and so I, I believe in it, I believe in my, my product, I believe in all the benefits, so I stay put with, with all its, its benefits intact. I, I do not succumb to any, anything less, okay, so I maintain that, that benefit and I put out to the market, to the people, uh, yes, you want to bring your mate, but sorry. This is a parent-child, so I, I do not compromise, and and I, I basically um, the way I get other parents involved is through experiencing mm. the, the the trial class, the classes. So they go back and they tell their friends, their relatives. So Little it's more mouth. of a grassroots. Right, yeah. Right. So for example, each each parent that enroll, I said bring four more friends mm -hmm. or four more relatives. So it, it just spreads out like a wildfire. Right. So yeah. avoid the temptation to take shortcuts, right? For yes. business and commercial reasons, right? Yes, Very important. Yes, yes. So stay put with, you know, maintain the same logo, the That's same right. color, the same program. 45 minutes class right. is 45 minute class. So uh, the core yeah. values, right? Yes, right. yes. That's yes, the way yes. that's the way I guess it should be as well. Mm -hmm. So that you have actually consistency in, yes. in terms of the brand. Consistency. Just that's, like, the, that's the branding. Right? That's yes. the branding. Yes. Because yes. like for example, you go to a KFC, you go to a McDonald's, worldwide Starbucks, it's somewhat standardized. How you see in terms of the franchise, yeah. the outlets, the service, the food, everything the food yes. should be yeah, yeah. should be identical, identical. right? Identical, right. that's yes. right. So so you must maintain the same standard. Right. The, right. the color, the services, the hi, hello, good morning. Mm. It, it has to maintain maintain that. Right, yeah. right. Yeah. And of course, word of mouth and this kind of are very personal and is the most powerful form of advertising, isn't exactly. it? Exactly. Because exactly. people can speak from personal experience yes, yes. and from the heart as well. Yes. yes. So when you maintain that, you will have the return of the same client with their first child, their second child, mm -hmm. and their third child. So being that in Malaysia, we have been here for 15 years, so I've, I've had my probably my, my older student from Jimbury 15 years ago is probably today 17 or 18 years old. Right, amazing. When this, when this program is only meant for up to five years old. Wow, okay. wow, it has evolved in such a way already, yes, right? Yes, <laughs> right. yes. Right, and of course, not only that's not just within the family; it actually spreads to relatives as well co as close friends, close workers, yes, colleagues, and yes. it just goes on and on. Yes, yes. Now, coming back to this, we were touching about uh, the internet and okay. social media before yes. the, the commercial break. Now, we yeah. all know that it's a g big game changer in Correct. today's day and it is, age. It is, yeah. Now, previously, if someone was not happy with a particular brand, they would have to, you know, uh, type an email or send send a letter to the company. Discreetly. And, yeah, discreetly. discreetly and that's it. You don't Correct. know whether it, anything is actually done about it. But yes. today, you can go on Twitter, you can go on Instagram, you can go on Facebook, you can go on blogs, websites, yeah. and basically, the whole world can see. The whole, yeah, you can destroy the brand, basically. You can, exactly. You can so it's quite brand. scary, isn't it? it so is. what's your thoughts on that? Huh? Okay, um, yeah, social media, like I can say, it's either, if you know it, you can make a lot of money of it. If you make one small mistake, you can screw your reputation, hence your brand. Mm. Because, um, yeah, okay, yeah, you have the mainstream industry, okay, yeah, blah, 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 uh, TV, all that. Okay, um, I have a friend who actually work from home. Okay. Uh, he's a businessman selling a uh, health product. Online business, Online is it? Online business, purely right. on Facebook and website. Mm. And now I can say, he just, I think he, he was interviewed by um, TV9 like yesterday. Sure. Back then, now his um, company income is 138,000 ringgit monthly. And wow. the sales of the product like 2.2 million last year. So Amazing. He solely re, um, depend on internet and Facebook. Mm -hmm. And apart from that, he also have his own branding, his own tagline. So that okay, when you meet people, okay, let's say he's sending the product to the customer right. and 
even customer see him, his personal page on Facebook, he always has a dis distinct um, trademark of himself, right. which is this. <laughs> he always yeah. do this. And every time he writes something on Facebook or even texting us, right. he always ended with uh, copy satu. Okay. Okay. So and basically, apart from okay, you're making your empire, you're making your business empire through right. online. So but you also brand yourself, and by the right. way, people will know you. And because of you have some like friendly trademark, people right. tend to get to know you, and eventually people will buy product and you make money. That's right. It. I think there's a it's a something like an association as well yes. as anchoring a particular visual correct, effect. Correct. I guess one classic example would be Donald Trump on The Apprentice. Yes, You're yes, fired. Yes. So everyone thinks of that. They straight away yeah. it anchors to Donald Trump correct. as well. I mean, right? Donald Trump is not the top 10 richest man in the world. No, he's not. But people, I mean, around people the world, know people him, know, still that, know okay, him. Yeah. Maybe, he's, he's, maybe he's the richest man in the world. Mm -hmm. So in, indirectly, he brand himself. That's right. And indirectly, he marketing his whole property, like the Donald, the Trump Tower, That's right. whatever he has under his business. Mm -hmm. So when, uh, from one um, effort, you can exploit the rest with this one effort and you can exploit everything. And now that you have social media, okay, you can, okay, let's say you have Donald Trump page, then you can link all of your business that's through true. that Facebook page. And basically, that's your marketing already. Then right. people will know you and... Another classic example is Sir Richard Branson as well. Yes, he yes, is yes. a powerhouse when it comes correct, to correct, yes. branding as yes. well. You know, he's yes. an icon in that sense. So yes. it, it shows. I still, as well. uh, yeah, I still remember when he well, he used to just throw sending papers on his neighborhood. I mean, I, I when he first started out, right started from out, the very very beginning. Basically, yeah. his first business, and I mean, I, I read his book. And now he's a tycoon. I mean, mm -hmm. and also like Donald Trump, he's not in the top ten richest man in the no, world, but not. people know him. He brand himself as not a boring uh, corporate right. style. I mean, uh, with the long hair, right. with the beard, with uh, girls. So That's he right. made himself a very, very um, fun person and mm. people like it. And eventually people, okay, this is a fun uh, person. Yeah. They can connect with him, him as well, which is very yes. important. And, and his brand. Connecting, he's connecting back to people. And mm. I mean, I mean um, he's English, but still people like him. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> <laughs> right, right. Now, coming back to uh, Jimbery as well. Now, we all know that uh, it has been 15 years already. So, can you just share with us a bit about the progression in terms of the last one and a half decades with regards to building the brand? Of course, you have come a long way. So, hopefully now it's somewhat easier days. Can you share? Well, um, of course, like I said in the beginning, it was tough, but uh, persistence, perseverance, mm. and um, trying to um, have the marketplace have the trust in you and time again and again to show the same benefits that they, they earn and um, to have the emotional attachment as their child grow and to have the memories of beautiful time that they have their little one so with that it evolved right and when they share it, it, we become a bigger family. Right, right. Yeah. So over the 15 years, um, they have evolved, and I've seen um, it multiple. Mm -hmm. So just like having, you know, from one center to two to three, coming up fourth, and there's two more also in Singapore. Right. You mentioned about evolution, which is which is a very very good word. Now, what about the evolution with regards to the techniques, with regards to uh, the, the setup? The, the teaching methods and We maintain all the same. Same, huh? the same. same. Mm. Because okay. one, once you have the same uh, technique, um, you build the loyalty. Right. And, and consumers have trust in you. They have the first experience of a good time. They want that, the return of the second um, emotional attachment with their second child and their third child. So for me, it's, it's about consistency. Right. It's about uh, building the trust with the customers. And for me also, it's about value for your money. Mm -hmm. Yeah, though we have, you know, gone through times and, uh, it, you know, changes in, in inflations and stuff like sure. that. Of course, the price has increased from sure. time to time. But once they have established the value for the money, the trust, the loyalty, they're willing to pay. Yeah, so it's, they, they see the value in it. So yes, that's the most important so, thing. So we, we, we have that. Right. We have that. So again and again, 
I still have customers with me today from, from 15 years ago. Right, right. Now, what about the advent of technology as well as the internet and so forth? As we know, times have changed considerably today as compared to 15 years yes, ago. Yes. Has that been incorporated? Of course, okay. yes. We, we have to because before we were handling uh, uh, customers with um, where there is no internet, mm. there is no iPad <laughs> or, or handphone. <laughs> That's you right. know, so like I said, we have evolved through time. So we have to use the different techniques now. So we we have uh, communication with the customers through Infoblast, right. through um, internet, um, using the web. So that's how we, we stay in touch with the customers Fantastic. and and to keep them updated and stuff like that. So before you used to have a lot of flyers. So now we post one uh, one information and the customer will just come and snap the picture. Correct. And, and, that's and share it. it and share it on Facebook. And share or it. That's yeah. Right, that's and you right. know how fast it works with, oh, with yes. you know WhatsApp and, and you know messages. It yep. just spreads out. Yep. So it does make our, our advertising or our information out to Market public a mm. lot faster. Well said, well said. Very much, much, much faster. More, much cheaper as well. Cheaper and oh, faster. Yes. faster. Oh, that, yes. that's the, the Save the environment too. Very important. Oh, yes, <laughs> yes, definitely. 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 Yeah. Now, now, coming back to branding, just now you can say it's a double edged sword. It can actually uh, the internet can actually help you or it could actually kill you in, 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 in essence. Yes, yes. I think one of the very, very most uh, used words with regards to this is customer engagement. Customer engagement, yes. Okay. Engagement, yeah. that's right. You know, in the sense that people post up, you don't reply, yes. then suddenly, oh, this company X, they don't respond, correct, my complaint, correct, like that, correct, like that, correct. has anyone, then suddenly you get all these yes, people yes. responding. So, engagement is very crucial, yeah, right? It is, it is crucial. It's very, very crucial. Um, bec and also, you must know um, how to manage the risk if, if, if somebody posts something bad about you. Mm. I mean, how you manage the risk when, uh, I mean, and how do you respond to it? How, how, what's your word? I mean, that's right. I mean, if one, if you use one hostile word, you're gone. That's it. Yeah. That's it. It but I mean, even though you know, they can throw a shit to you, but if you know how to counter it, I mean, right. um, I think the most, I mean, customer is always right. Mm. Maybe you can apologize for right. any inconveniences, any un inconveniences. Then, I mean, eventually, yes, people know about it, but because you respond to it, because right. you don't just uh, sit behind the bar, so you sit right. behind the computer and do right. nothing about yeah. it, eventually people ignore will ignore it and the kind of thing, yeah. And people, people are like, okay, wait, this is nothing. So mm. then, okay, lah, I want to use this, I want to use other right, stuff. Right. If you're engaging, then people, okay, I complain about you, but you're engaging me. And, yeah. and you're taking their apart from complaint seriously. Ap yeah, apart from just um, commenting on the public status, then they can mm. go to PM, then they can resolve it. I mean, then eventually, okay, problem solved. That's right. Continue business, That's making right. money. Life goes on, right? Yeah, so it's on. also about timeliness as well, that you yes. must respond uh, Reasonably fast, Correct. otherwise people think that you're not no, taking. No, not really fast. I mean, I mean, you can take times because I mean, may, maybe from one comment, but maybe this person comment, maybe there's a few other comments right, from the users. Right. Maybe you can take time. I mean, depend on how you want to manage. Or perhaps at the very least, send a holding reply. Thank you for your uh, complaint yes. or your feedback. Yes. We yes. are looking at it right Correct. now. Correct. Do Easy. you know? Do yes. hang on for a bit, yes. and we'll revert yes. back to that. At least Correct. people know that someone is looking into it. And I yes. think that that's very crucial yes. as well. And if and if you see on job street, there's a lot of posting about social media <laughs> person, you know, because that's right. You know, in a big corporation, they need someone to take care of their social media. Right, right. Yeah, that's true. There's a, there's a great demand for those kind of roles in mm -hmm. the future. We're almost running out of time very, very quickly, Hisham. Yeah. Can you just share with us for those out there who like to build their brand, be it mm -hmm. personal brand, brand of their products, brand of their services, what is the one thing they should focus the most on? I think stay true to themselves and don't be a copycat. Right. You know, you know what you want, you know what you are. And like um, she said, no, maintain your value. Don't ever change it mm. for a decade, for a century. And uh, best example is KFC. I mean, you can taste the same chicken from 10 years ago, from first they started until mm. now. True. Same chicken. That's right. So maintain your value and maintain your authenticity. You know what? Pe this is internet. Pe people can just search, hey, these people is copying this thing. That's people, true. Yeah. And have a good um, brand development plan. You know, you know what you want. You know, you know, uh, was, was that? You know how far you want your brand to go, right? Or you just want to be like what Malay said, you want a kampung, or you oh, want to go international. Yeah. You want to have seven hundred um, brands all over the world. So you know what you want, and that's right. And hopefully, with your it. passion, your enthusiastic, and your eager to be successful, hopefully you can develop your brand and you can be up there. Right, Fa fantastic. Uh, quickly from you, uh, Jasmine. What about you in terms of starting a business? Any one piece of advice you can give? would be uh, entrepreneurs out there? Okay, I would say believe in your product, mm -hmm. be consistent, 
um, giving the best that you can and um, stay loyal to your That's own right. brand. Never sell out. That's right. No shortcuts. There's no, no shortcuts. shortcuts. Yes. No, no shortcuts. don't look at quick Stay deals. loyal. Yeah. Fantastic. All right then. Thank you very much, Hisham and Jasmine, for the insights with regards to the business, the brand that it plays, which is so crucial in making your business very, very successful. That's all the time we have for FaceTime right now. But when we come back, we've got more corporate developments and business news here on Capital Today.